All right, guys, welcome to the video. Today, we are going to remake our plug that goes from our generator to our house. I made this plug when we used our old generator, but the plug ends are a little different this time. So see how the one prong goes to the outside of the plug? Um, the generator plug um, has the uh, kind of plug where it goes to the inside of the plug. So as you can see here, it has the plug with that goes on the inside. That's a 30 amp. So we went up to the store and we bought a new 30 amp plug. You can get these right on Amazon. I'll leave a link in the description down below so you can check them out. They're a little cheaper on Amazon than they are at Self Serve Lumber, just to let you know. What we gotta do is we gotta unscrew this and then hook the wires up on the other one and then we should be all set. So let's get at it. So we're going to unscrew these ones. Hey, Dad. Hey. Then we got to unscrew the end here. Why might the lights flicker? So we got the head on plug. And now we have to unscrew each one of these. No, no, nobody's going swimming when it's going to rain. Alright, well, I mean, I don't think it's very smart. It looks like it's going to storm. All right, so on this plug, it's got all the letters on there. I don't know if you can see those, but there's an X, a X, a W, X, Y, and G. W, X, Y, and G. Yeah, girls, I know, out of the pool. Get back in here, now. All right, so each one of these are color-coded. We'll have to see what the instructions say on this one. Yeah. Yeah. There. As you can see, we're kind of racing against time just in case the power goes out. We want to have this all taken care of before the power actually goes out. But um, hopefully we're not too late. But there's some spooky looking clouds. Nothing like waiting until the last minute, I tell you what. So these ones are um, labeled the same thing, W, X, Y, and G. Wow, that is crazy. And now it's really raining. So we need to hurry up and get this done. All right, so here we have the instructions. It says the G is the, the, the ground wire, which gets the bare, bare wire. The W gets the white or gray wire. X, Y, or Z will get the, the red, black, blue, or any other color except white, green, yellow, or bare wire. Which one's the black one? W is the white. So we are... These all lined up here. Alright, I'm gonna Oh and the power's starting to go out. We might get to use the generator. It's already I thought it was you, but it's already like twice. No, that's not very Oh I forgot. Also you never want to put this on until you put the little shroud thing on. I've done that each time I put the ends on this thing. Previously. 
So now we're gonna hook that back up. So the brown goes in the green one. The black one is in Y, is that right? Black, red, blue, yep. So Y gets a black one. Okay, and then the white one is in W, is that right? White or gray, yep. Okay, then we just gotta screw the red one down, which the red one is in X. So you always wanna follow the instructions that are given. With your um, plug ends. And then what you do is you slide the little uh, cover up so that it fits back over top of the end. On this one there's a little there's a little indent right there at the top that you line up theoretically. So once you get it lined up then you can put the screws in. Okay, they're good and tight. Then we got to put this part back together and that will prevent the wire from being pulled on. But yeah, you can um, you can just buy a wire that's already made, like an, it's a fancy extension cord. Um, I went up because it was uh, during a big power outage and we didn't have any cords near us. I just went and bought the wire in the, in the ends. And then since we got the new generator, the ends were different. So I had to upgrade the end to something different. But, there we go. Now we can plug it into our generator. Now we're gonna hook it up to the generator. And then lock it in. That way it don't come out. And then it's all set. And then you plug this end into the outlet to the house. So hope you found this helpful. If you did, make sure you hit thumbs up button. Um, also, if you want to make one of your own plugs, I'll leave all the parts down into the uh, description down below there. You can check them out on Amazon. Also, if you want to see uh, the video of uh, the unboxing of our generator, um, that link will be on the screen. And then uh, you can also check the generator out on Amazon. There'll be a link down in the description below for that as well. Oh, and if you want to watch other generator review videos, click the links on the screen or down in the sidebar. Thanks for watching. Oh, and I forgot to take that part off. Son of a gun.